Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, I'm in Photoshop 2023, the most recent version of Photoshop, and I'm going to show you how to integrate or install Stable Diffusion. And we're going to do it in like two minutes at the most. So, as you can see here, I'm in Photoshop, and all of a sudden I've got this little window here that says stability and it's a plugin and it allows me access to stable diffusion how did i do it let's go through it step by step first step we'll just head over to the browser and the first website i want to show you is this one here i'll put a link in the description below but it's the fella who made it his name is christian cantrell he created this plugin and it's very very easy to install there are two methods you can install it directly through the adobe exchange or you can download it and put it into your uh one of your folders I went and clicked on install it from the Adobe Exchange. When you click on that, it's going to take you to this site right here. As you can see here that I've already got it installed. But what you need to do in a nutshell is basically go to the Dream Hub Studio or the Dream Studio API and get there. You just need an API code from Dream Studio. So to do that, I'm going to put you into the next phase of it. And that's just to go to dreamstudio.com. And when you're on dreamstudio.com, Click up here at the top, it says launch image generator beta.dreamstudio.ai. Click on that and presto, it will take you into Dream Studio. I already have an account. If you do not have an account, you can just go through the account set up very, very quickly and it is free. So it's a beautiful thing. Once you're in this far and you've signed up, you'll see a whole bunch of stuff. All you need to know is over here on the right side, click on your icon and then underneath it, go to my account. When you're in your own account, one of the tabs is API key. Click on API key and then just click on create API key. This creates one for free and then just click the copy button right here and then head back into Photoshop. By now, you should have the stability installed if you've already gone to our website here and installed it. Once it's installed, you'll go back into Photoshop like I just did there. Under plugins, you're gonna see stability. So just drop down to stability and then make sure stability is selected. Once it's selected, you'll see a few things, API key, stable diffusion, Dolly 2, if you want Dolly 2, and history. We just want to click on the API key. And once you're here, we're going to go ahead and just leave it as is. Just copy in the API key right here and then just go ahead and save it. Once that's done, you can now go in here and you'll see stable diffusion. And then I can just start go ahead and creating dreams. So this is, they're not, it's not called generate in this one. It's called dream. So just click on dream. And then in a few seconds, we'll have four new images that we can select. And then in a neat way, you can add it as a layer. You can click on the seed or you can even save it as. So I like to add it as a layer. So if I like this one here, I would just click layer and okay. Yeah, that was a little bit of a deformed little puppy dog. Maybe not that one, but that is literally all there is to it. There's our, oh, we got six out of this one here. Here we go. I'm going to click. I'm going to add this one. Presto, dog reading a book, stable diffusion in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.